let's have a little look at compare docs. Now, for those of you uh, that are familiar with compare docs, you will see an immediate change. Uh, you can see here that the UHI has changed just slightly to uh, indicate to you that we're using the Enterprise Edition. This will be the uh, white panel in the middle and the two gray bars across the top. Now, if you've used compare docs, of course, you'll also be familiar that you load your two documents in and you hit this compare button down here. And you've got some options, you know, such as you save into uh, your DM system, you can email and copy, but also you can open a, uh, the option here to view into a new document. The three pane view is this option here. It will do the same thing. It'll open it up into a new document for us, and this is the view you will then get. What we've got here is a lot of changes in the document. You can see over on the right, I have my original at the top here. I have my modified at the document. We have a few little controls around that. We can make these obviously bigger and smaller if required. Um, but also, it's not just about uh, that particular paragraph. If I'm scrolling through the document, if I click, hey, say up here, for example, to look at this paragraph, when I click it, you will see the two windows will change. It's sort of a click to sync. Uh, so you can sort of scroll through and you can now see that that will sync with you. So you can navigate through your document and wherever you want to, uh, to have a look at the original and the modified, if you just click on the document, you can uh, see that section there for you as well. So it just enables you just to be able to work through that document. It does the other way as well. You can actually click within the original or the modified and everything will sync for you. Now, as you can see, though, the reading pane, OK, for this particular section I've got here is in one window. I've got my source and my modified document here. But when we go and visit our clients, a lot of people are working with comparisons. They want their main document they're working on on one screen. But usually everyone's got two screens. So what we want to be able to do with these is actually dock these elsewhere. Now, I do have some options. Yeah, at the moment, I'm showing both the original and the modified. Uh, but I may just want to see the modified document. I might just want to see the original. That option is also available. And you can see here the other options that you would expect with a, a docking tool like this. We can dock these at the top, at the right where they are now. I can go left. I can go to the bottom. But more importantly, um, I can display um, as a whole new window as well. Now, if I do that, OK, and what I'm going to do here is just change the view of uh, this recording so we can see both my screens. And now if I choose this option here, OK, just to dock in, uh, into a separate window, you will see that now you can see your document on screen one and on screen two, you've now got both those changes as well. And of course, the click to sync still carries on working as you would expect it to as you're working through the document there. So really, we just give you that ability just to be able to do that. And of course, if you don't want to see the three pane view, you've got an option here to hide it. OK, so, you know, you can uh, just turn it off if you want to. So really, it's just a case of just trying to help you work through um, with a nice three pane view, these more complex of uh, paragraphs. Mm -hmm.